Game one of the Stanley Cup final is going the distance and more tonight. Avs and Lightning are headed into overtime, currently tied up at three to three. The Avs started astonishingly strong, scored their first two goals in the first 10 minutes of the game, happened within three minutes of gameplay. But then in the second period, the Tampa Bay Lightning answered back, scoring two goals in just over 20 seconds. The game has been tied up 3-3 three to three for a while now, so we're going to head to Rod Mackey inside Ball Arena as soon as that game wraps up. I am coming from Boise, Idaho. Uh, Wichita Falls, Texas. Des Moines, Iowa. New Zealand. Uh, small town, Prongia. No, no one in New Zealand really knows where it is either, so... What? Every seat at Ball Arena was sold out tonight. Avs fans coming from near and far. Far being Jack, the uh, fan from New Zealand. He was also here for games one and two of the St. Louis series as well. That's cool to see. Hundreds of Avs fans took over Tivoli Square there just south of Ball Arena to watch the game outdoors tonight. And that's where we find 9 News reporter Kelly Rinke. I mean, we knew the energy was going to be wild, but this game... Oh my gosh, it has been so much fun. I hands down had the best assignment today. The quad right in front of Tivoli is packed with fans as people are anxiously waiting to see if the Avs will take home the W tonight. And to build everything again. Here they are five years later hosting game one of the Stanley Cup Finals. Let's go! We want the cup, baby! Let's go! This moment is 21 years in the making. It pays to be a loyal fan. It does. Abs faithful. We're doing it. I know we're doing it. It's time. Woo! Abs fans are watching their team in the Stanley Cup final for the first time in two decades. Oh, I think it'll be tough, but as long as everyone stays healthy, I think there's a chance. It's time for a new one. Colorado is ready to be champions again. I'm trying to channel my car. Defense wins championships, baby. Tivoli Quad by Ball Arena was packed with fans for game one Wednesday night. I got here at 2 o'clock. We're as faithful, and this is what we do. We show up, and we're going to watch a win. I'm 24, so I was uh, I was about four years old when uh, when we won it the last time. This feeling doesn't come often in Denver. We deserve this. Yes, we do. Yeah, we here early. So it's worth showing up hours early. Why not? Why don't you want to be up front? You can get the best action. You don't have to walk over people's shoulders. Victory is what fans came to see. I will remember this one, so not happy with being in the finals. I'm going to be happy when we win it. Oh, baby, the abs are going for the cup. Their time is up. The Avs are winning. The Cup's coming to Denver. So Denver is ready to bring the Cup home. We're having so much fun here. This event is free. They're going to be hosting these watch parties every single game, both home and away, guys. Well, we wondered what they were going to do when they said they wanted to serve booze outside and have some more room. That's pretty big. <laughs> Yeah, they they figured it out. They found the beer. <laughs> <laughs> they found the uh, beer. It looks like a party. All right, Kelly Rinky, thank you.